Um, Ryan, just talk about the way you guys battled here. You were down 3 nothing going to the fifth. Uh, Dominic Fleming gets that big one out hit. How big of a hit was that for you guys? Oh, it was huge. Uh, he's the nine hitter and uh, we know what we bring to the table, but not many guys do. And Dom's a heck of a heck of an athlete. So for him to be able to roll over the top with a hit, start all the momentum, that just left us uh, with some momentum and we were able to uh, cash in. And then you're up and there's runners at second and third after the infield single and the wild pitch. Just talk about your hit and, and getting you guys on the scoreboard and what that meant. Oh, um, I just looked for my pitch as always. I got into a little bit of a count, which I didn't want to do, but uh, I got the pitch I wanted. I went, went with it to right field and I was able to uh, find a hole. And then your brother comes up with you at second. Oh, actually, you're at third because you had the stolen base. Uh, was that a delayed steal? Or what, what happened there? That was a delayed steal. We uh, noticed that the shortstop and sec uh, second baseman weren't paying a whole lot of attention, uh, so we decided to try it, and uh, luckily it worked out. Um, and, and then were you surprised that they played the infield back there? Uh, no. Um, I mean, they, they have very good gloves there, and... Uh, they believe in themselves. They thought they could get back in with a hit, so to concede a tie, they, they felt confident, I feel like. So, uh, Reed did a heck of a job putting the ball in play, and we were able to cash in. And then Sterling, obviously, with the double. Um, you know, how excited was how excited was the bench at that point? Oh, we were elated. Uh, us as a school, we've never made it this far, so to be able to make it this far is something uh, truly incredible. Uh, and then you guys were able to piece it together. I want to talk about the fly out that you got coming in in relief. Um, you know, bases are loaded. What are you trying to do there uh, after all the walks? Oh, I'm just trying to find the uh, strike zone. Uh, they haven't seen a whole lot of strikes. Uh, I don't blame Sterling. He was having some uh, accuracy trouble. That happens, but uh, I'm just trying to find the strike zone. Get a ground ball. I trust my defense. I know they uh, have my back, and if I can get a ground ball, I know that uh, I could get out of that. And knowing that you had your brother to, to finish things off for you, how uh, how confident were you guys with Reed? Oh, we have all the confidence in the world in him. Uh, he, we know he's the ace of our staff. Um, he he has done amazing all this year. That's why he's the KSEC MVP for a reason. So um, if he's on the mound, we know we have a shot to win any game. And, and then just talk about getting to the second round and, and maybe putting away some of the disappointment of the district championship game. Um, it's huge. Uh, our confidence after that game was uh, down a little bit. And uh, the fact that we were able to make it this far, farther than any team has in our school history, is something pretty special that uh, I don't think we realize have sunk in yet.